it's the day I've been looking forward to for days, weeks, months, years. I love when you wanna waste time. Hit my phone when you wanna come by. Need you alone in my bed all night, all night, all night. I love when you wanna waste time. Hit my phone when you wanna come by. Need you alone in my. I still can't wrap my head around it, but I'm moving out tomorrow. And it's happening and I'm like, what do you mean? We're just getting ready to go because I'm getting my keys today and the official moving and everything, the bigger stuff will be tomorrow. I just got my keys. I still can't believe that this like my place I and mean, i didn't buy it no so it's not like mine technically but like this is my place let's start with the little hallway this is where you come in obviously and these two things were already here when i tell you my landlord did everything i mean he did everything like everything is already here right here you can see an extra storage room then right next to the entry there's also the bathroom And then you come into the actual part of the apartment. Everything is just one room technically, so it's one big space. This was also already in the apartment. You can see that the mattress is still new. Girl, I literally don't have to buy anything anymore. So next to the bed, there is a couch. You can actually turn that into a bed. This is like the dining area, kind of. And I have these two big windows. There's the little kitchen area. This will be kind of my closet area, obviously. And I'm planning to buy another desk to kind of separate my work, office area, whatever. Because I don't like having one table for everything. Today is officially moving day! Yay! It's my favorite day. It's the day I've been looking forward to for days, weeks, months, years. Girl! Ah, the English line! It's the day where I get to spend all day at IKEA, picking furniture, choosing decoration, living out my dream of interior design. I'm so excited. I love, love, love decorating homes. My home, sorry, my home. Of course, I have a whole Pinterest board for the inspiration. Like, come on, that's like common sense at this point. So I have to get ready to leave soon because we start at crack of dawn. The minute they are open, I'm inside of the door. I just wanted to give like quick context to this whole video. Cause like, what even is happening, right? I know it's not visible anymore, but I had jaw surgery a few months ago and while recovering I actually had to start looking for apartments because I'm moving out. It's exciting! I'm moving out and I'm moving away from the city that I've lived in for the past 10 or 11 years. Not that. Because your girl is starting college. I know that's a whole nother thing to wrap my head around but we go on baby steps first i have to realize that i actually have my keys to my apartment so you know just casual just to life-changing events happening in the next month moving out and starting university but <laughs> nothing big but my priority is just getting settled at my new place before all the school stress starts again <gasps> i can't i haven't been to school in a year and so my plan is just to make my apartment feel a bit more like home, you know, live, laugh, love, um, stuff like that. Anyways, before I spiral and get an identity crisis, let's get ready to go to IKEA! Ah, ah girls day! Let's go! Let's go! 
I hate driving after my mom was driving the car because she's like half my size so everything is tiny now so every time I have to rearrange the whole car but anyways let's go the three of us you me and this brick wall you built between us Two was looking like. We finished building this whole thing. These are the parts of the old closet and in the hallway you can see the new closet that I got today but we will finish that tomorrow because um, it's like almost 11 p.m. so <laughs> that's not. Also I put these two shelves in front of the bread. Also I put these two shelves right in front of the bread. Right in front of the bed. I don't know if I like it like this. I'll have to see what I do with it. Now I'm just going to make the bed and sleep. Let's go. This is the progress so far. I have to do these right now. I have to use a hammer and it's so loud. It's so loud. And there are two of them. Like it has to be completely flat on the surface. It's so loud. I feel like my neighbors are going to kick me out of this house because like 
I feel like I should have warned them like, hey, it's gonna be annoying today, I'm so sorry. Won't go deeper, so I think this is it. The first one is done, and now I'm starting to worry that the second one won't fit. But there are only so many problems I can handle in one day, so I will worry about that tomorrow. <laughs> I have to do all of this one more time. This is the second package, it's already waiting for me, so let's go. I started the second one, but I got to the part where I had to use the hammer. I don't think so. I just realized that I forgot my charger. Isn't this amazing? I have 15% left. I'll have to buy one tomorrow. And I already looked up how I have to get there and wrote it down. <laughs> Let's hope I find it. Cause like, first day in the city, no GPS, no internet. I <laughs> guess I'll finish unpacking the small stuff that I started and then just cry myself to sleep. Yay. Charging and on the way home it started raining of course of course silly me still oh my hair is still wet okay anyways silly me still doesn't have an umbrella so 10 out of 10 experience today i obviously got the charger 25 euros 25 euros for a cable not even the adapter because i just use the one from my macbook 25 euros for a cable and this was this was the cheaper one there was one for 30 euros which was longer i don't need that 30 euros 30 euros for a piece of cable anyways i also grabbed two more things one of these it's cute now i have one now i'm like a professional or whatever and two of these like, I guess this counts as one, but it has two parts. It's musty, crusty, and dusty already, but they all look like this. I don't know, I was just like, girl, it's fine. Like, I'm pretty sure I saw that I needed this. If not, now I just have a fancy tool in my house, it's fine. I'm pretty sure it's this one. Um, Miss Girlie didn't have breakfast. Miss Girlie won't have breakfast. We're skipping right to lunch because I'm big time hungry. I'm like lunch type of hungry, so... I finished the second half of the closet and... Look at her. It fits! Yeah, I did it. <laughs> it was so easy. Did not cry at all. Obviously, the doors are still missing, but I do not have the will to continue building this closet right now. I have to go to the city hall and do all my registration and stuff. Just like the legal stuff, you know, big girl stuff. Anyways, I gotta go now. I gotta look somewhat professional, I guess. I guess. So. I don't even have half my clothes here, so this is what we're working with. But I guess it's fine. I'm back. Yeah, let me show you what I got. Lemons, onions, garlic. I 
got shrimps. This girl is going to be wifey today and cook something delicious. Ice cream just to simply treat myself at this point. And the most important part. I bought flowers for myself. Today has been one of those days and I just wanted to express my self-love. And they were pretty, so I thought why not cook some dinner. today i built the whole closet i mean it's not finished but it's standing where it's supposed to be i don't know i even did laundry today like i did so much i cooked dinner and it was amazing i don't know why i still have this feeling as if i hadn't done anything today somehow i'm thinking like oh you literally didn't get anything done today which is not true so i don't know why i have this feeling i also feel really weird when going somewhere like i'm just sitting in the bus i have this weird like tense feeling in my muscles like i can feel my whole body just being like then why is my fight or flight activated in the bus you know i don't know i don't know I don't know why today was so weird. Like I try coming down by listening to some music, to some comfort songs, but I still feel very anxious. I started self-reflecting on the bus, like this is how intense it got. I was like, okay, why am I feeling this? Like, am I, am I scared that I'm in the wrong bus or it's the wrong direction? Or I forgot my ticket, but that's impossible because I have it on my phone and it's there and I can just look it up and blah, blah. I don't know, I don't know what is making me feel all these emotions. Why is this turning into a therapy session? Um, but I guess today will be my first existential crisis here. Anyways. 